So this ought to be interesting. Let's use a ridge runner to open a ridge runner. Oh. Okay. This this one. Whoop. That was a big job. Handled it well. Good job, buddy. Okay, let's turn that over. Neat. Oh. Oh. Well, I'd have to say that this paracord, it's actually surprisingly soft and gushy. It's actually, it's actually kind of nice to grip on. Now, I know that once I start using this thing, the, the cord will probably unravel somewhat. But, my just initial impression of this paracord wrap is that it actually feels pretty good. I actually kind of enjoy it. Checking if there's any rattle. Doesn't seem to be. Of course, we'll uh, we'll bang it on stuff and find out at some point. Interesting. That's pretty cool. Okay, that does not strike me as terribly sharp. In fact, let's point a cardboard tab over here. Let's just see if it cuts it like a knife or not. Nope, it doesn't. Look at that, guys. Very dull. Yeah, this this does not... That blade does not have blade sharpness. It's pretty blunt. Now these are interesting. These are actually multi-tool options. For, well, these are at least. Um, I'm not sure if those are just stylistic or what. So, it's hammer on the back. That's pretty cool. I'm gonna try that on a filing cabinet. I'll try the whole thing on a filing cabinet. We'll do one of those videos soon. This just does not... It is dull. Honestly, guys, it's dull. So as far as this goes, I don't really know exactly what to tell you yet. Uh, the blade is pretty dull. Um, I mean, it is pretty cool. It would be handy to have. Uh, my first impression of it is, let's say you know, keep it in a bug out bag or something just in case you need this tool for something and, and couldn't, you know, spare the space for a socket set in your uh, bag or whatever. But, uh, you know, the, the fact that it's also a hammer and an axe combined with a multi-tool kind of thing, that's, that was sort of the appeal to it for me. But uh, definitely didn't come super sharp. I will try to sharpen it a little before I test it, probably, because I just think that'll make the testing more fun. But uh, anyway, that's the uh, that's the axe thing. Let's see if there is an actual name for it. Well, there's a model number. It's RR828, but um, that's just Ridge Runner Model 828 didn't have much information about the item itself in the packaging, just the item and its little sheath. So, I really don't know. Um, this is the first time I've ever got something like this, so I'm not really familiar with it or anything of its kind. Uh, so, we'll see. That looks four millimeters thick or so, or maybe even five, so it does look pretty thick. All right, well, that's it for today. I gotta clean this mess up.